Hello KG2! In today's art video, we are going to learn how to make this wonderful Easter box or Easter basket. In this, you can put your Easter candies or your Easter egg. So let's learn how to make this. For this art project, you will need your markers or crayons to color the pictures, glue stick, a pair of scissors, and in your folder, you will find this Easter box template. Girls have pink and boys have blue. And you'll also find a hard sheet of paper like this. It, it might look like this or maybe like this. But that doesn't matter because we are going to use this side. Alright? So let's start. First, we will start with coloring our pictures so you can use your markers or your crayons or your color pencils and use your favorite colors to color all the pictures let's start Now, after you have finished coloring, it will look something like this. So you color the egg, use your favorite crayons or your markers or color pencils. And you can color it with any colors. This is the cross. It says, He is risen. Remember why we celebrate Easter, right? Because God so loved the world that He gave His one and only Son, that whoever believes in him shall not perish but have eternal life. And this is the bunny with an Easter egg and a basket. So you can use any crayons or markers or color pencils to color your pictures. Now for the next step, you will take the hard sheet of paper that you got in your folder it looks something like this at the back or it might also look like this okay that doesn't matter because we are going to stick this on top of this now the reason why we are sticking this on top of this is because we want the box to be hard right we don't want it to break so first step we will cut this okay so get your scissor and we will start cutting this and remember to cut outside the black line. Alright, so now after you cut it, it will look something like this, right? Now your next step is to take this sheet and your glue stick. So we are going to glue this on top of this. So you turn your paper over that you cut and apply glue everywhere. Now take this paper, remember we are going to stick on this side, do not use this side, okay? We need to use the red side, not the blank one. Now take the paper that you have cut and you need to glue it on top of this. Just like that. So it will look like 
this to look something like this okay make sure you've glued everything properly now the reason why we are using this is because we want our box to be hard right we don't want it to break easily that's why we stuck this on the hard paper now after you finish gluing this you have to again cut the edges okay the box so we will cut all this part so after you finish cutting it will look something like this and now it's time to make our box so you will need to fold along the dotted lines you see the broken lines we are going to fold that part so let's start we'll start with this so you take this and you will fold it inside okay now this side let's fold it inside now the other side let's fold it inside after you fold it will look like this you see how we folded it inside and on the other side as well now it's time to fold these these lines so fold it inside also here inside this one inside and this side also there you go you have to fold it so you get a nice fold after you get all your folds it's time to glue so you will put glue only on these flaps so that when we glue it all together it's like a box can you see that so you put glue only over here on these on these flaps over here so let's start watch carefully just putting glue here let me put glue on the other side as well now it's time to join it you can take the help of your mom and dad for this after you glue it you might have to hold it for some time so it stays you glue it Now it's time for this side. You can see this is already glued. There you go. If you feel like the glue is going to come off, you can also tape it, okay? You can use tape. If you feel like the glue is coming off, no problem, you can use tape. So there you go, you have your box. You have the cross, the Bible verse, the bunny holding a basket, and your Easter egg. Now after you have made your basket, you can put your Easter egg in it. You can store your Easter egg, uh, maybe some candies or more eggs. So you can keep a lot of things in your Easter basket. You see, a lot of candies. <laughs> or you can all just fill it with eggs, whatever you like. And there you go, you have your basket.
So there you go. You have your Easter box and you can store your candies and also your Easter egg inside it. Now remember, after you finish making this, you will not send this to school. So I want you to take a picture of the Easter box and yourself, you holding the Easter box and send it to me as soon as you finish making it, okay? Do not forget to send me your pictures. Goodbye.